welcome back to my another Swift tutorial. Today I'll show you how to create how to use UAP pen gesture recognizer. So before we start doing our project, let's look take a look at what it's gonna do. Whenever you swipe swipe right or left, it's gonna change the color. So that's all we're gonna do. So it's just a simple concept how you UAP, UAP pen gesture recognizer works. So let's get started. Create a new project single view application for iPhone and name UI gesture recognizer All right next create and now first thing disable auto size uh, layout it's gonna be only for iPhone so disable alright now click on assistant editor and then grab a pen gesture so select a view and look for a gesture and we're gonna use this pen gesture so go ahead and drop it to your view now uh, press control and you see this gesture right there control and drag it to your con view controller and it's gonna be an action and uh, pen gesture and it's going to be UI gesture recognizer connected. Now, for now, we don't need a main storyboard, so let's go back to UI view control and change this to a single editor. So, we don't need this data receive warning. And now let's create a one variable called square. See, it's going to be type UI view, or we don't really have to tell it. UI view this is going to be so now create that view before we create a view we need to get the size of the view size is equal to cz rect x float okay so we want to uh, since it's going to be a, a hundred times hundred uh, square I'm just going to get the middle like the center size of the view so it's going to be self dot view dot bounce dot mid x minus 50 because it's going to be 100 by 100 so that way it stays in the center self dot view dot bounce dot mid y and it's going to be 100 like I said and now since we have the size let's go uh, let's create our view UI view and CG rect is the size. Let's give it a color, like initial color self dot square at UI uh, background color is equal to UI color dot black color. And now we have created our view, but we have to add that to our sub uh, main view. So we're gonna say self dot view dot add sub view, and it's gonna be square. And if let's go ahead and run and see what it does. So there is a black uh, black box right there. It looks like it's not in the middle, but oh, okay. I need to subtract this by fifty. That's why, and let's rerun it and it should be in the middle. There it is, it's in the middle, all right. So now, so we're done with that for now. I'm gonna add uh, one more method. I'm gonna explain what it does. So it pretty much returns a UI color depending on what random number was chosen was given by the system so if it's one it's gonna give you blue color it's, if it's two it's gonna give you red color if it's three so on so on so that's all it does so now uh, whenever you have pen just if someone swipes their um, finger we want to check to see if it has ended or not because there are three states you can do it uh, whenever a gesture begins Whenever gesture is in the current state and whenever gestures, gesture ends, so we're gonna do it for whenever gesture ends. So 
let's we're gonna use this variable sender so if sender dot state is equal equal to UI gesture state as you can see here begin canceled changed and ended so it has four four or five my bad it has five five of them so we're gonna like I said we're gonna use for ended so and once it has ended we're gonna change the color of the the box dot background color is equal to I'm just gonna say change color and let's run it see if that works there it goes works fine so that's all for this tutorial thank you guys for watching and please subscribe and like this video thank you guys for watching see you on next tutorial